for the ingredients you'll need 450 grams of potatoes, 2 carrots, 2 frozen tomatoes, 1 bunch of coriander, 1 onion, half a green pepper, turmeric, and finally a pinch of salt. Let us begin with preparing our 450 grams of potatoes. The first step involves peeling our potatoes. Start by preparing our potatoes and place them on a clean and flat surface. Ensure you have a sharp potato peeler or a small knife. Carefully hold each potato as firm and on the other hand, use a peeler or preferably a knife to move the skin working from one end to another. Take your time to peel off all the skin, making sure you remove any eyes or blemishes that you come across. Continue this process until you have completed all the potatoes and they are peeled and ready for the next step. Now we wash our we wash our vegetables. That is the potatoes, carrots, the coriander, the onion, and just a half a green pepper. After washing them as thorough, in order to remove any impurities, we can peel our carrots using the peeler. Make sure your hands are as firm as we peel because we wouldn't want any injuries. With that done, cut off the end of the onion and let us peel it. In a pot, let's prep the potatoes using a sharp, sharp knife. Dice the potatoes into cubes, the larger ones into fours, the medium ones into either threes or in half, and the smaller ones, well, 
the smaller ones can go in as whole. Cover your potatoes in water and boil them over medium heat for about 10 to maybe 15 minutes. We turn our focus on vegetables, the carrots, coriander and onion, not to forget the green pepper. First things first, let us pack on the onion, it's already peeled so slice it from top all the way to bottom and take one half and cut slices and then of course repeat the other half. Take the bell pepper and cut it into tiny cubes now the coriander where we cut it in half and dice it accordingly lastly the carrots using a pillar as, as firmly as possible with a pillar at hand let us create the carrots into tiny chunks Also, before I forget, do not hesitate to let me know where exactly you're watching from. Leave us a comment below and I'll make sure, I will definitely make sure to give you a shout out in the next video. I mean, your support really means a lot to us and I would love to acknowledge all our amazing viewers from all over the world. So, drop a comment and stay tuned for our special mention. Our, our potatoes should be ready now, so let's get rid of the broth and pour the potatoes into a bowl using the same same pot add some cooking oil followed by the onions and the green pepper and let them cook until they turn golden brown before adding in the frozen tomatoes cover for five minutes and add in your potatoes the turmeric and a glass of water stir then cover with the lid and let it boil for another 8 to 10 minutes.
if you have not yet subscribed i highly recommend you, that you do so make sure that you also hit the notification bell to stay updated with all of almasi's latest videos by subscribing you will never and i mean never miss out on any new content exciting recipes or helpful tips your support means a lot to us and helps us continue creating great videos for you to enjoy don't miss out so this is your time subscribe and turn on notifications now we can safely add in our coriander followed by carrots and another glass of water since it will be stew that we are making stir a bit then cover and let it pulp another final two minutes before we are done There you have it. Serve your newly made dish with rice. And now have a plate of dinner. Thanks.